stricter visa extension rules. What immigrants in Canada need to know. Welcome back to Canada Chronicles. In today's video, we're diving into something crucial for anyone navigating the complexities of Canadian immigration, especially with the recent changes that have just taken effect. If you're a temporary worker, an international student, or a visitor in Canada, these new visa extension rules might have already impacted your plans. But don't worry, we're here to help you understand exactly what's happening and what you need to do to stay on top of it. This video is packed with valuable insights to guide you through these stricter regulations and help you avoid potential pitfalls. Make sure to stick around until the end because we'll be discussing essential strategies for meeting the new criteria. These tips could be the difference between a successful visa extension and having to make unexpected changes to your plans. Before we dive into the details, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update on crucial immigration news and tips. Let's get started. Canada has long been a destination of choice for immigrants seeking better opportunities, quality education, and a higher standard of living. However, recent changes to visa extension rules have created significant challenges for those currently residing in the country. Whether you're a temporary worker, an international student, or a visitor, understanding these new rules is crucial for maintaining your legal status and avoiding potential pitfalls. The issue at hand. Stricter visa extension rules. The Canadian government has introduced stricter visa extension rules as part of its broader strategy to manage the growing number of temporary residents and address the immigration backlog. These changes, effective from August 28, 2024, have significantly altered the landscape, making it more difficult for many immigrants to extend their stay in the country. The government's rationale is to ensure the integrity of the immigration system and manage the influx of temporary residents, but these new measures have created a more complex environment for those already in Canada. Previously, many temporary residents, including visitors, were able to extend their stay with relative ease. The requirements were straightforward, and the process was generally predictable. However, the new rules have introduced more stringent criteria, increased documentation requirements, and reduced flexibility, leaving many immigrants uncertain about their future in Canada. Navigating the new requirements. Under the new rules, visa extension applications now undergo increased scrutiny. The government requires applicants to provide a compelling reason for extending their stay, which could include demonstrating a strong connection to Canada, such as employment, family ties, or ongoing education. Additionally, applicants must prove they have sufficient financial resources to support themselves during the extended stay. For temporary workers, the process has become even more complicated. The end of the temporary public policy that allowed visitors to apply for work permits from within Canada means that individuals who were previously eligible to extend their stay by obtaining a work permit now have to leave the country to apply from abroad. This has created significant barriers for those who were hoping to transition from visitor status to a work permit and eventually to permanent residency. International students are also feeling the impact of these changes. The new rules have introduced stricter eligibility criteria for extending study permits. Students must now demonstrate satisfactory progress in their studies and present a clear plan for completing their education within a reasonable time frame. Failure to meet these criteria could result in the denial of a study permit extension, forcing students to return to their home countries before completing their education. Documentation and proof of intent. Documentation has become a crucial aspect of the new rules. The government now requires more detailed documentation to support visa extension applications. This includes proof of financial stability, evidence of ties to Canada, and a clear explanation of the purpose of the extension. For many immigrants, gathering the necessary documentation has become a time-consuming and stressful process. Applicants must also clearly demonstrate their intent to leave Canada at the end of the extension period. This requirement has always been part of the visa extension process but is now enforced more rigorously. The government is particularly focused on ensuring that temporary residents do not overstay their visas or use visa extensions as a way to remain in Canada indefinitely without transitioning to permanent residency. Thanks for staying with us this far. We appreciate your time and hope you're finding this information valuable. Now, let's delve into the specific steps you can take to navigate these new challenges. Strategies for meeting the new criteria. Given the stricter rules, it's more important than ever to approach your visa extension application with careful planning and attention to detail. Here are some strategies to help you meet the new criteria and increase your chances of a successful application. 1. Start early. Begin preparing your application well in advance of your visa expiration date. This will give you ample time to gather the necessary documentation, seek legal advice if needed, and address any potential issues before submitting your application. 
2. Provide comprehensive documentation. Ensure all required documents are included and up to date. This includes proof of financial stability, such as bank statements or proof of income, and evidence of ties to Canada, like a job offer, enrollment in an educational program, or family connections. Clear and thorough documentation is key to demonstrating your eligibility and intent. 3. Demonstrate intent to leave. Clearly articulate your intention to leave Canada at the end of the extension period. This could involve showing a return ticket or commitments in your home country that will require your return. IRCC is closely scrutinizing this aspect to ensure compliance with visa regulations. 4. Seek professional advice. If you're unsure about any aspect of the application process, consider consulting with an immigration lawyer or registered consultant. They can provide valuable guidance on meeting the new requirements and help you avoid common mistakes that could lead to a denial. 5. Explore alternative pathways. If extending your current visa is not feasible under the new rules, consider alternative immigration pathways. For example, you might be eligible to apply for permanent residency through a provincial nominee program, PNP, or the Express Entry System. These programs can provide a more stable and long-term solution for those who wish to remain in Canada. These strategies are essential for ensuring your success under the new regulations, so approach your application process with the necessary care and attention the impact of stricter rules on your immigration status. The consequences of failing to meet the new visa extension criteria can be severe. If your application is denied, you could lose your legal status in Canada, making you subject to removal orders and potentially jeopardizing your ability to return to Canada in the future. It's essential to understand the risks involved and take proactive steps to avoid them. For those already facing difficulties due to the new rules, it's crucial to act quickly. If your visa is about to expire and you're unable to secure an extension, you may need to leave Canada temporarily and reapply from your home country. While this is not an ideal solution, it may be the only option available under the current regulations. Long-term implications of the new rules. The stricter visa extension rules are likely to have long-term implications for Canada's immigration landscape. By making it more difficult for temporary residents to extend their stay, the government is effectively encouraging immigrants to transition to permanent residency sooner rather than later. This shift could lead to an increase in applications for permanent residency through programs like express entry and the provincial nominee programs. However, the new rules could also deter some individuals from choosing Canada as their destination of choice, particularly those who are uncertain about their ability to meet the stricter criteria. This could have a ripple effect on various sectors of the Canadian economy, particularly those that rely on temporary foreign workers and international students. Solutions and alternatives. Despite the challenges posed by the new rules, there are still pathways available for those who wish to remain in Canada. One option is to apply for permanent residency through one of Canada's many immigration programs. The express entry system, for example, allows skilled workers to apply for permanent residency based on their qualifications, work experience, and language proficiency. The provincial nominee programs, PNPs, offer another route, with each province setting its criteria for nominating candidates for permanent residency. Another potential solution is to seek employment with an employer who is willing to sponsor your work permit. While the process for obtaining a work permit has become more stringent, it is still possible with the right support from an employer. Additionally, if you are already working in Canada, gaining more Canadian work experience can significantly improve your chances of obtaining permanent residency through the Canadian Experience Class, CEC. For international students, one of the best ways to secure a future in Canada is by excelling in your studies and applying for a post-graduation work permit, PGWP. This permit allows you to gain valuable Canadian work experience, which can be a crucial factor in qualifying for permanent residency. Navigating the stricter visa extension rules in Canada can be challenging, but with the right knowledge and preparation, you can successfully maintain your legal status and continue building your future here. By understanding the new requirements and utilizing the strategies we've discussed today, you'll be better equipped to handle these changes and explore alternative pathways if needed. Remember, staying informed and proactive is key to avoiding potential pitfalls and making the most of the opportunities available to you. Thank you for tuning in to Canada Chronicles. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who might benefit from this information. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you never miss an update on crucial immigration news and tips. We're here to help you every step of the way on your journey in Canada. Until next time, stay informed and see you in the next video.